All right, what's up everyone and today we're playing a brand new game I have been waiting for for a while and this one is called the plucky squire now This kind of mixes in with 2d and 3d I'm not sure if you've seen any of the trailers, but I hope y'all will enjoy this playthrough of this game Don't worry. We will be continuing our playthrough of Astrobot and everything. Sorry I was so gone like I was gone for so long and stuff. Uh, I just was super busy with real life things and everything so Let's go ahead and jump in with the Plucky Squire and then of course in other days and other games and everything we will be continuing Astrobot and as well as some other stuff. So, new game. Start game. Adventure mode, story mode, a breezy way to play, relax, enjoy story. If you're feeling plucky and you want a challenge, this mode is for you. Like, I'm just confused. Like, a breezy way to play. I, I would like adventure. You know mode. Um, I don't know if story mode doesn't have any enemies normally story mode is like a walkthrough type of thing You know, like I don't want it to be that easy. I want you know, I like normal difficulty. What's normal difficulty? The plucky squire Once upon a time there was a plucky squire named Jot. What's up, Jot? Jot lived in the land of Mojo, a land of creativity. Mm. Mojo was ruled by the gentle queen, Chroma. He defended the land from the nefarious sorcerer, Humgrub. Humgrub. I like that name. <laughs> very much appreciated. Good lad. Well done. Jot was also a writer and would transcribe his many adventures in book form. Excellent. These tales were avidly read by all the people of the land, who found them quite gripping. Jot awoke one fine morning and pluckily leapt from his bed. Mm -hmm. From afar, he could hear some rather exciting music. He got dressed and went to investigate. Chapter 1 Some Serious Beeswax All right, there we are. So see, this is what I was talking about. Like it's it's like a, it's kind of like a little 2D, well, I guess like top down type of thing, but then it jumps into like a 3D stuff. It's pretty nice. The music was really booming. Look at that music. Okay. This was the house of the good wizard, Moonbeer, Jod's close friend and mentor. Ah, Jot, my lad, he exclaimed. I'm on a roll here, traveling to new musical realms. Since you're here, lad, I have a small favor to ask. Yes? Wax. I need more wax, lad. To press more records, you know. Would you go to Honey Peak and get some wax from Benny B? Pip here will accompany you. Appreciate it, Pip. All right. Okay, a mini quest. Hua. Okay, you take your goblins, and I'll haul the beeswax back here for you. Okay. Yeah, there will be goblins. Uh, no sweat for you, though. Yeah, yeah, we got this. Entrance to the woods beckon. All right, so go ahead and swing like that. You hit the goblins. Got it. Can I can I actually like chop down trees or anything? Just chopping bushes. Oh oh, you actually get stuff. Okay, that means we got to chop every single bush known to man. Goblins ahead.
Okay, goblins have been eliminated. I don't know what this, uh... Oh my gosh, you actually get some from hitting trees! <laughs> okay, yeah, a shift. Nice, okay, we got a good roll there. Okay, I don't want to go... What does what this way you say? To Tome Tower. I don't know if I want to go that way. I kind of want to go up here. What's up here? Gate swung open for Plucky the Squire. Excellent. Thank you so much for opening up the gate. Is this where I'm supposed to go? <laughs> like, I, I don't want to go where I'm supposed to go. Like, I would like to explore and get everything. Okay. Oh, this is where I'm supposed to go. Okay. Honey Peak. Okay. We're at Honey Peak now. So what if I go back? What happens? Absolutely nothing. Okay. So yeah, we'll figure it out. I, I figured this is how you jump. Okay. Now this is really quite precarious. Let's uh, show that those disappear, basically. Yep, makes sense. Did it. These are basically, it's a little floaty, uh, the jumping. So that's something to get used to. A little bit floaty. Uh, view's incredible. Oh no. Uh oh. Honey Badger eating Benny, uh, Benny B's buzz, uh, but, oh my gosh, Benny B's honey. <laughs> if you're on your toes, jot the honey. Badger can really, okay. I didn't fully read it, I clicked through it. it it's something about Cranky. Let's go, let's hit him. Oh, I wasn't planning on hitting. Oh heck, here we go. Boss fight. The honey badger seemed rather annoyed. I would say so. Jot prepared. Ooh, man, Jot up. ripped. Oh my gosh. Where are we? What is this? Punch out? Oh, I dodge. I dodge. I guess we'll just hit him like this. Got him. Easy. I didn't dodge the first time, but that's because I thought I thought I could hold it, but apparently you can't. It's only the for a quick second. Was bested. Excellent. Yeah. With my ripped muscles. The lucky squire. Triumphant. Alright. Back in the high, it feels good. Yo, many thanks, Jot. You did me a solid. That honey badger was really messing with my beeswax. So far as I could really do with some of your beeswax, if you have some to spare. Mm-hmm. All right. Huh? What's going on? I don't know. What's with all this ominous darkness? Interesting. Interesting. <gasps> Down they fell. Oof. Lovely. It was time to confer with Moonbeard. All right. 
All right, there's something rather odd about the magic he used. This is not usually how the story goes, you know? Forget about that. Hmm. Hello? What's up? You got a paintbrush, it looks like. It was Violet. It's Violet. Violet was a trainee witch with a love of art. And Jot's childhood friend. As Violet seen Jot's ripped arms. All right, we gotta take care of, take care of all the malarkey. I, I don't really need luck. I got this. Kapow, lead the way, Jot. Okay, first we gotta break all these again. You know, cause we're getting more of these, I don't know what they are, light bulbs. Oh, I'm sure we'll figure out eventually what they are. Hey, at least I got to go this way. I'm guessing. Oh man, I destroyed that little rat. So I just got hurt for a second. Does that mean I'm 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 trying to I'm curious off of like will that replenish automatically or what do we get? is this you got a new piece of artwork press tab to show in the gallery I will hit tab there it is right there concept area of the mountains looks pretty good excellent yeah I like the way that that's pretty cool nice okay so th those give me health I guess also I don't know or just health just a uh, Slowly comes back. I don't know. Got 41 of those though. Spring in his step. A gleam in his plucky eye. The blank swung blank. Oh yeah, we gotta we gotta pick up the gate. The gate swung up. So is that where we're supposed? What if you put it in the wrong place? Like. Like, I'm guessing it's supposed to be the gate swung open and stuff. Oh man, I thought he... thought he was gonna die there. So like, yeah, I know it's supposed to be the gate swung open, but like, what if I say the open swung gate? Like, what happens here? Nope, okay. I was just curious if it actually... No. There we go. The gate swung open. Puzzle complete. I always had a way with words. I am a writer. I am a writer. Hello? Hello, weird. I don't know what this. Okay. Martina? Hello? Show you. Oh, okay. So this is like a shop. All right, a new art scroll, or a sword throw badge. Well, got to get the sword throw badge. You know, makes sense. Uh, acquiring this. So there we go. Just got the sword throw badge. Okay. Yeah, sure. Let's go ahead and test it out. Oh, cool. Okay. Excellent. We are taking care of all these guys. There we go. Good going. If you want to keep training, take out. Okay. Let's go. I kind of want to buy that other little bit. Like, 
like, I want to see, I want to see what else you have. Like, you have the art scroll right there. Let's go and buy that. Ooh, you got a new piece of artwork shown in the gallery. Hey, we knew we wanted to feature a boxing minigame, but it took a while to land exactly where your opponent would be. A giant muscular duck. Okay, good. So it looks like a giant muscular duck is going to be something I'm going to be facing. Excellent. All right, that's everything I have. Let's go ahead and collect some more of these. I only got 16 left now. All right, taking care of that bird. All right, took care of all those. What is this back here? I got something. You found a lost uh, glitch bird. It will return to its homeland. I don't know what that's about, but excellent. Okay, just making sure there's no other side paths here or anything like that. All right, let's go and get moving. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. Oh, Isn't she that. supposed to be, can she like uh, cause all that stuff to stop? Chapter midair so two. we can stand there. Tome Tower. Just saying. That would be nice. Our heroes hug on to the cliff's edge by their fingernails. When suddenly. Uh oh, what's happening? They were grabbed. Nice. And hoisted up. By who? By Thrash. By Thrash. Thrash was a mountain troll. And George and Violet's childhood friend. The trio had not been together for quite a while. And so were very happy to be reunited. Excellent. Let's continue with our stuff here. All right, Trash. Oh, boy. You really saved our skins. We're happy to see you. Uh, triple Trouble together again. Mo Jam. Mo Jam. Okay. <laughs> Come here, both heading to the tower. Figure I'll help you on the way. Path is right, huh? Well, there's more than one route to the tower. Let's get down to the ground. All right, we just jumping off. I'll do it. Let's go. I was just seeing if I can hit him like that, but I guess I can't, I don't know. How about we come over here? Can I go that way or is it invisible? Like, is it blocked? I think it's blocked. Let's check with this side. Yeah, it's blocked. Oh man, don't want to get hit with that. All right, purposely let that break. I don't need the heart. Ow! Uh oh, uh oh! I thought I was supposed to drop on that. Apparently not. Oh, I could jump on him. Good to know. What? I totally hit him. What's up, Thrash? I got here. It's cool. It's cucumber. Where's the where? Where's she at? The one girl. All right, sort of. All right, yep, uh-huh. Lead the way, Plucky Squire. Okay, let's go. Well, first, hold on, hold on. There's a lot of stuff that we could collect. You gotta break all the bushes. It's 
like whenever in uh, Zelda, like you gotta get all the rupees possible. Look at those bouncing boulders are just vanishing into thin air. Oh no, they're going 3D. Right. Collecting all the goodies. So far, we got it all the way back up. What is this? To the tower. So let's go and get going. What are you? A bull. Looks angry. John is wearing red. <laughs> I don't think bulls are that picky. It's true. Bull has been taken out. There we go. We got another art piece. Mm hmm. Let's check it out. Let's see what it says. Uh, all right, early concept design. This is where Jot uh, was a writer and didn't have the quill in his hat. It's true, he did have the plucky disposition. Okay. Let's go. We got it. Why can't I swing? What's happening? My mouse is on the screen right now. There. I don't know, some, some glitch. My mouse didn't reconnect. We got it now, though. We got it. All right. Let's go and keep going. There's a wizard. How do you get down here? It's a tiny Moonbeard. It's like a tiny version of Moonbeard. A mini beard. I know I need a key. I don't need, I don't need, I'm not stuck. I don't need his help at all. Come around over here. It doesn't look like I can do anything there. Clearly, none of my companions want to come with me over here. See how it is. I had to fight this guy all on my own. Okay. First, we're just collecting these things. And we'll go up the stairs. Easy. Easy. Which I could have done some of the throwing stuff, but eh. Oh, whoops. Hold on. Let's don't get let's go ahead and break all this stuff first. I don't know. It may have some secret inside of it. That is a big key. Alright, let's go. You got the key. I knew you could do it. I know. Thanks, mini beard. Thanks for helping, companions. All right. Here was a secluded forest. All right, it's secluded. Big old cat. Topsy. Okay. So you're on a quest of some kind. Do you know Topsy may be able to help you? All right, uh, sure. Namely, my tummy. All right, we gotta go get some biscuits. All right, yeah, we'll do that. Where's that? Is?
Okay, we don't want forest. Can we put this over here? Where's a secluded run? Like, I don't know, like... All right, we go ahead and pick up the forest part over there. If we pick up run, here was a secluded run. That doesn't really make sense. But it's like, I, I do wonder if anything, you know, will happen if I, uh, oh, a ruin. I thought that said run at first. I didn't see the eye. So here was a secluded ruin. What does that do? Oh, interesting. Interesting. That is really cool. So if we pick up forest and do something with the forest. So let's see here. Why do we need to talk to me? Okay, Jot found Topsy's biscuits. Oh yeah, this is this is heavy here. Do we have to put the biscuits right here? Like, do you put them on that spot? Is that what they're for? Like, to kind of tell you the idea. Let's go ahead and pick up forest real quick. Let's try to separate this a little bit. Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Get in there. I don't want to attack these guys here. You know, just cuz. Gotta get them. Yeah, exactly. I may get some of the light bulbs. Alright, so now let's go ahead and go back to the ruin. Can't believe I said run originally. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I'm like a secluded run. What is that? Oh, dang it. Come on. Alright, here we go. There's your food, Topsy. There you go. You got your biscuits. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. We are the Biscuit Saviors. I like that title. It's a good title. All right, here we go. Okay, there's another person there, but first let's go ahead and try to acquire a few more of these, uh, whatever they're called. There we go. I got 118. I'd say that's pretty good. We meet again. Care to take a look? Yeah, sure. Let's take a look at your selection. Oh my gosh. Jump attack badge. Uh, spin attack badge. I can't afford any of those. But the sword damage upgrade I can afford. You know what we're going to do? Sword damage upgrade. Let's go ahead and purchase that one. Our sword is stronger. And let's do an art scroll. So we have that one as well. Hey, Moonbeard. Nice. Early character design of Moonbeard before his sunglasses. I would like to point out that he looks so much better uh, with sunglasses. So now my attack is stronger. Do I do anything? Okay, no. Let's what is that? Skip minigame? Oh, you can actually skip the minigame? Is that, like, I was like, is there any, um... I guess there's not anything here. Okay, I don't want to keep going, because I can collect a few things first. There we go. We got up to 60. That works. Ooh, ominous music Our playing. Our trio stopped in their tracks. Oh, no. There, on what the is it? Horizon. What's on the horizon? Loomed Chobe. Tower. Tome Tower. Dun, dun, dun. All right. Got dark around here pretty fast. There's some magic afoot. Everything feels kind of fizzy. There was a strange electricity in there. A bug. That was like a 3D bug right there. 
Look, this is like glowing. Can I hit that and get something? Yes! So I gotta keep an eye on the trees. Just in case they may have something like that. A new piece of artwork. What is, what is this artwork here? Uh, got a character Pip. There's really a trickster kind of character. He turned out to be evil. The Pip now featured aim is all good, we think. Don't do that to me. You're gonna make me think that he's not all good. <laughs> Okay. Let's go ahead and collect a few of these little things here. All right. Perfect. Ooh. Ooh. Booming bolts. Very metal. Like, will that show up? Will something show up? Okay, yeah, something does show up, so I know not to... For you. Nice. Strange is electricity was spawning monsters. And keep it going. Ow! Nice. Got a heart with that. Got to be a little more careful. Got to do a little more dodging. You know. Ooh, got a heart with that one as well. That was a big heart. See? Always hit the stuff. Never know what you'll find. Nice. Okay. Nice. Did it much better that time. Had some good dodging and everything like that. Excellent. Excellent. Let's go ahead and keep moving. Ooh, what is that? A bookworm? Yep, that's where we're headed. Best beware, Dark Widow occupies the tower. His magic is causing a pandemonium. I mean, look at this, uh, lovely bridge. Yep, I know. I know. Any way to cross the waters? Just, uh, okay. Oh, okay. We'll figure it out. Look, there's a secret tunnel. Secret tunnel! Alright, there we go. Okay. We won't go down the secret tunnel just yet. We're gonna hold off. You're gonna hold off in case we find something secretive. Over here. Seems I can't go anywhere there. Okay. So let's go ahead and move into these dungeons. Well, this is spoopy. It is. Ooh, we got a secret there. And I don't trust any walls. I don't trust any walls. Ow! Hmm. 
Hmm. I don't know how to get up there. Aha. Uh -huh. Excellent. Impassable cave. Not that impassable. Oh great, oh great, oh great! What just happened? Like I like infinitely <laughs> fell there. Now I'm really hurt. Across the river. Okay, pick up these. Need a lot more. They have that, man. I, I could have saved earlier, but the thing is, though, I didn't want to save earlier. Like, you know, I, I could have saved to get some other stuff, but yeah. Anything around here? Yes, I can. Yes. See if you have anything. Okay, so sword throw upgrade and art scroll. You know what? We're gonna do sword throw upgrade and art scroll because that's only 10. Might as well. Look at that. What just happened? What just happened? I don't know what just happened. Oh, I think I accidentally clicked off <laughs> of the thing. Sorry about that. I accidentally clicked off some early custom game environment. Okay. All right, that's all I can afford right now. I'm gonna have to continue going. You look at all these books scattered about. Cool visual though. <laughs> awesome. Gotta collect as much as possible. All right. Okay, that's everything. Oh, forgot that bush. There we go. 71. These books have been purposely stacked. Got him. Okay. Since those have been purposely stacked, let's go ahead and come over here. Got yeah, looks like a key right there. But where do we even put this key? Okay, and it looks like we have other stuff. Can I go on this side of the books? Yes, I can. Got a scroll there. Got to pick that up. Nice. All right. Looks delicious. It does. Very delicious. All right, so I guess let's go ahead and pick this up. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, we got bad guys. Oh man, this is nice. There we go. Killed him. Got it. We can bring the key out now. Okay, big blocks of books. Okay. And we have this right here. Good. Page were scattered on the ground. Okay, there's a little mini guy. 
Okay, um, oh yeah, don't you hit, okay, pages scattered, okay, so let's move scattered, yeah, yeah, and this is over here. So instead of them being scattered, they're gonna, like, this one will be stacked. So all those will be nice and neat. Oh my gosh. Yes. And it's only if it has that one thing it I could do this. Okay. Let's go ahead and stack this over to here. There we are. Now we can continue to the next portion. Uh that wretched fool jot. Huh? I uh, he will get what he deserves. The time is near. Uh, the dirty plucky squire. Someone's not happy. It's a plucky squire trying to enjoy things. No reason to get angry over it. What just happened? Oh, I went back. I didn't mean to go back. No, no, no. Go back this way. I guess if I go anywhere in the lower portion, it does that. Gotta remember that. Okay, so that's all the bushes. Let's continue on to the next spot. The land of Mojo. We have crossed through everywhere. Now we're at Tome Tower. Hello, mysterious person. This is where it all is a historical location and no mistakes. Huh? Hmm. Well, hello and goodbye. Okay. Well, yeah, yeah, you're gonna say that. We get it, we get it. We'll mooch from down here instead and cheering. <laughs> yeah, 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 we get it. All right, let's go. Jot made his way up the steep steps. Well done. Well done, Jot. Ah! Oh, do I have to click? Sorry, sorry about that. Didn't know I had to click. The plucky, plucky squire. When you are so glad to see you made it from Tome Tower, you might be wondering what, uh, I'm Hmm. I had a hunch grump. I might find something interesting in this whole tower. Hey, what'd you find? A book! It was hidden away in this very secret chamber because this is a very special book. The title of this very special book is... The Plucky Squire. Yes, that's right. This book is all about you and me and all who live in this dreaded land. It is the story of our lives. It turns out you see that our land of Mojo is just a setting in a storybook. Hard to believe, I assure you, it's true. What I'm holding here is a copy of that storybook, a book, a book within the book, if you will. I read the book, it's very interesting and uh, you and that witch girl adventuring through the land, meeting up with the mountain troll, making your way here to meet me. In fact, I read ahead uh, to this very chapter. I've seen what happens next. We fight here on the roof. Any guesses how that turns out? Well, why don't you tell me? And so, the bloody squire once again defeated the wretched wizard Humgrum. You win, as you always do. You know, this book is one of a series, and in each one of those books, you win every single stinking time. Oh, he's upset. Because you are the plucky squire, the hero of this story, the boy who can do no wrong, always victorious, even the little stories you write, beloved by all, infuriating like a 
like a mosquito in my cardigan. Yes, that is an adequate metaphor. <laughs> Me, I'm the villain. The talentless wizard who can do no right. Destined to be beaten forever. You shouldn't, you shouldn't say that about yourself. At least, that is how it has been up until now. But maybe it doesn't need to be that way. Maybe even Hump Grump, Hump Grump uh, could get a little glory for once if the Plucky Squire were to be plucked from the book. If he were to be ejected. Ooh. Three-dimensional. This is actually a very ingenious way of making a game. Oh. Peanut? Okay, there's an arrow over there to say go that way. But... So far, everything is just controlling... Fantastic, even out here. I'm just curious. I, I kind of want to like roam, just you know, just take a look around, just in case. I don't have my sword out here, so I can't do anything. All right. Guess we'll go ahead and head this way. But yeah, there's that little bug that crawled across there. Oh, hello? Is there someone out there? I'm out here. Would you be so kind as to open the lid of this lunchbox? Uh. Hey, okay, do I come up to here and grab? S to open. Okay, there we go. Ah, it's the bookworm. Page. Travel around a fair bit from book to book. Shouldn't really be out of here. Yep, uh huh. All right. There we go. Alright, so there's things like we got a carrot, we got a grape. That's a okay, meta magic portal, that is. It seems there's a lot of travel between different worlds. Most characters cannot travel through these portals. Map pass between rails. But Jot, you've already made that leap once. Maybe you could do it again. Try jumping through the portal. Okay. Well, I'm gonna do it while holding this carrot. I can. Oh. All right, nice. There's a carrot for you. There we go. Didn't even know. Oh, oh, interesting. That's cool. It's so trippy. Yeah, I know I could go that way, but like, I don't want to look around. Anything I could do here? I don't see anything I could do. So I don't think I don't think there's anything here. Okay, we need to get over to there. So how do we do such a thing? Okay, go to here. There's there. 
Oh my gosh, I didn't realize I could go along the side of that right there. Walk up here. Go ahead and push it over. Nice. Love this so much. All right, uh, okay, but listen, on your way, to run a creepy crawly, okay. Beetles! You worried, Jot, don't get eaten. Simply wouldn't do. That wouldn't do if I got eaten. It wouldn't. I don't think there's really much I could collect out here. I'm um, at least currently right now. Uh oh. There's a beetle. Okay. And we got sneaking in this and everything. Nice. Oh, I'm very tempted. Can I hit this? Dang it. Come on. I need the... When running or throwing. Oh, yes. Yes. Amazing. Okay, okay, we're gonna have to go get that die back. Run in here with it. There we go. Yeah, right here is a, uh... Dangerous location to be going around in. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We gotta sneak again. I don't know how to necessarily sneak. Got it before he could. Whew. It's a close one. It's a close one. Alright, here we go. What's up, Paige? Alright. So, something I really must observe. He's owner of a story, but I wonder if he'll come into play later on. Okay, fun of you and your adventures. I'm glad you got to see these, Josh, to see how much you mean to them. All right, press on. Let's go. Need that sword. That's what I need. Okay, once again, one of these. Hey, there's the die right there. Hmm. Okay, so that's how I get that to throw that up there. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get to it from there and walk along? Jeez, is that really what I have to do? Okay, this is gonna be tricky here. Yeah, I know. I gotta go around that red bottle there, it looks like.
Okay, where's he going? Where's he going? Is he staying over there? if he'll see me here. Okay. Careful. Where I need to get to, but there's this last one. What's his movement? Okay, he goes around like that. Goes around over there. It doesn't look like he hits this at all. So he goes there. Oh man, he goes around like that there too. Jeez, he is all over the place. How am I supposed to know where he's going? Go! Yes! Whew! Jeez, that was difficult. That was difficult. Because it's just so chaotic, those bugs, like the way they walk and everything. Okay. Here we go. I'm going to pick this up just in case. You know, might need it where I'm going. So instead of having to run all the way back for it. Ooh, what is this? Turn gauntlets. Now he has the power to manipulate his storybook. Press Q uh, when next to book to open it up. Oh, snap. Very important. What is it? If stop him from having not just to take the citizens of the book, but for all the children... Uh, who will read and be inspired by your book. Nice. Perfect. Lucrative uh, merchandise tie-ins and brand integrations. Sam's books will go on to inspire many other children. If he ever actually writes them. The story will get worse. Books with bad stories get put away on the shelf. No one reads them anymore. His books lose all of their life and cease being an inspiration to anyone. Her book will no longer inspire Sam and then who knows what path he will take. Do not let that happen. What if he has a better life because he doesn't write the book? You know? Just saying. <laughs> Alright. I'm taking this die with me. All the way to the end of this entire game. Aw, sad day. Okay, manipulate. Okay, let's go ahead and open. Oh, 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 boom. Okay, good. Exit. Welcome back. Chapter three. Chapter Moon three. Beard. Moonbeard. Nice profile there, Moonbeard. He's telling me he's gonna dance. Mm. Better put my best foot forward then. <laughs> Fantastic.
Let's have a great number of questions. The uh, answer to the first question is, yes, I'm aware of how cool these sunglasses look. Well, that's good. That's good. Yes, our entire world is indeed a land in a storybook. Okay, yep, you found out. Very regrettable. Is this a training? We come into the training course. Getting in and out of the book. See that green sparkly stuff over there? Well, I already know I can get in and out with that. Okay, walk to the portal, hold E. It's an E button. Not entirely sure, but you should press and hold it. It's like I've been doing this all the time. I got this. Rune tooth headset. Mm, get you some to drink, approach the edge of the book, and see what you can do. Here we go, let's take a look at this. Oh my gosh. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's go ahead and jump into this part of the book. Nice, we got his drink. Oh, there's a page up there. Got some fizzy pop. Still don't have my sword. Can I like continue on the page? Like if I go to the far right? What's happening? What's happening? Oh my gosh, I accidentally clicked off of the the page. I need to probably get my controller, you know? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's happening again where I see that. There we go. Can I go into here? What What's in here? Oh, I found another one. Yes. I wonder what that does. Like, I wonder if that'll do something in the future. So I'm really curious if, if I can go to the next page. I don't want to go to the portal. Guess I have to. All right. Let's go and hop in. Pop time. His thirst has been quenched. Okay, so he's the one who put all those items out there. Mini beard. Mm -hmm. If you're having trouble with the puzzle, you can figure it out. All right, I can figure it out on my own. I am Jot, Lucky Squire. All right, there we go. Let's go ahead and leave the book. And let's manipulate. Let's turn the page. We've lost John, I can't believe it. Yeah, hey, aren't you like a mage or something? Or a wizard? A witch? Whatever you want to say. <laughs> All right.
I love the rune tooth headset instead of blue tooth. That's, uh, that's just great. Conference call. <laughs> Need my sword. Excellent. Yeah. Now I can attack things. Fantastic. So that's where we're going to go ahead and end this episode. I hope y'all enjoyed this. This is a very interesting and unique game. Very excited to play it. As I said earlier, we will con be continuing our Astro Bot playthrough as well um, as our Beyond Good and Evil. Uh, I'll be, be, you know, recording some more of those here soon. Um, I don't know if I'm going to continue Star Wars Outlaws. It's just the game is just very boring to me. <laughs> like at first it was all right, but then the single player missions are getting a lot of rough. So uh, if you all enjoyed this game, leave a comment down below. Or if you're going to be playing this, uh, you know, at all, if you're going to be, you know, uh, just jumping in and seeing this unique game uh, or if there's any other games that you're excited for. So thank you all for coming out. Appreciate it. I'll see you all in the next one.